Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. It's day three, finals day of the Quake World Championship. We're here with the winner of our last matchup, Razy, taking on Chain, defeating him three to zero. And in fact, the Maestro team effectively in uh, zero six Chain out of uh, the tournament. So congratulations, Razy. It's great to have you with us. Hello, thank you very much. So I, I have to ask just the most obvious question, which is why do people continue to pick or allow you to pick Clutch and uh, maybe specifically on Awoken? Um, it comes down to the coin toss. Um, if, uh, if the coin toss goes in my favor, then I'm most likely gonna be able to pick Clutch. Um, and if it doesn't, then they can get rid of it if they want to. I, I mean, is it is it weird to you at all that that there is such an association between you, your play, this character, and then also just how much difficulty it seems to give some of the other players? Uh, clutch is a lot of work, and I think if you if you give, uh, put some time into it and and learn how to play him properly on this level, then he can grant you advantages no other champions would but as i said it is a really hard work to make it uh, viable um but i did put a lot of time into it and uh, it pays out maybe it's just because you make it look so easy i don't know maybe that might be it uh, i want to talk a little bit about your day one and your day two because i've looked through all the brackets we watched all the games and and i would go uh, up and argue that you had one of the most brutal runs through the entire day one and day two you won against toxic uh, you lost to your teammate venger but then eliminated avic base and cooler on your way to secure yourself for the finals you're here in the lower bracket but having gone through you know uh, such a, 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 a an incredible roster of players um how are you feeling about your performance so far here during the quake world championship um i'm just happy i'm not repeating what happened last stage finals because that's that was a disaster for me um yeah i'm trying to play it solid I'm not trying to risk too much and uh, trying to play it calculated in a way that, uh, you know, normally I would probably go for higher frag games where I just run at my opponent, but now I'm a little bit more restricted, restrained. Um, trying to play it safe to make sure that I'm gonna end up winning. And it has been working so far, um, not necessarily against Wenger, he's, he's insane in a good way. Uh, happy for him though. Um, but yeah, I just I just hope that I can keep carrying this uh, playstyle, and it's gonna grant me, uh, you know, good good results. And so we have four players left in the tournament: two from Team Maestro, two from Team Liquid. Uh, each of you is playing one of the members of Team Liquid. Let's talk about your next matchup. That would be uh, versus Dehang. Your thoughts on that one? Uh, I've met Dehang a few times already at uh, LAN tournaments. And he has knocked me out of tournaments uh, on more than one occasion. So I must play my best if I want to be able to beat him. It's going to be tough for sure. He's, he's a really good player in, in ways of how calculated he is and how well he understands uh, mechanics and, and certain aspects of the game. So I, I must respect that. Of course. And, and in, in your opinion, how, you know, how do you feel like you are playing right now um, as, as opposed to even to, to put it in context to like the entire uh season since the kickoff at last year's QuakeCon. uh sadly i've been all over the place um i haven't really been as consistent as i would like to be but i i feel like this uh, particular quake con i've been i've been solid and uh, you know, the upcoming like weeks to this event were like all over the place. Sometimes I was re playing really well. Other times I was surprising myself of how badly I'm playing. Right now I'm okay. <laughs> I'm just I'm, I'm just happy that it's 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 good enough so far. Well, it's definitely been good enough and entertaining. The fans at home uh, have been enjoying all of your matchups as well. You certainly gave us a, a great uh, action to watch during day one and two. So we want to say good luck to you in your upcoming match. And uh, uh, we're excited to see uh, how you'll do here for the remainder of the Quake World Championship. Razy, thank you so much. Everyone in chat, give some hearts out to Razy. He'll be going up against Dehang next. Thank you for joining us, Razy. Thank you.